In this demo, we'll create a cloud function that triggers when a file is uploaded to a cloud storage bucket. Okay, so here I am in Cloud Functions. I'm going to click Create a Function. We'll call this Storage Function. I put my bucket in US East 4, so I'm going to put my storage or my cloud function in US East 4. My trigger will be Cloud Storage. The event type will be Create, and then the bucket that we're going to use is a bucket I've created earlier, functions demo dar. And then hit save. Next we'll have to upload our code. I'm going to use Node.js, the latest version. And then we're going to need two files, index.js and package.js. I've already created those files. This will be the code for index.js. So we'll just paste that in our code editor here. Now notice what we're going to do is use Vision API and we'll upload a picture into the bucket and then the Vision API will tell us what's in the picture. So if we read down through, here's where we define our function. There's an event argument. The event argument will have the information about the file, namely the bucket where the file is stored and the name of the file that was stored. Here we'll create an instance of the Vision API and then here we'll use the Vision API to do label detection, passing in the request, which has the source of our image. That'll return a collection of labels, and then down here we're looping through each label, outputting each one to the console. Right? So we're not doing much with the labels other than logging them. But I guess if we can log them, we could do anything we wanted to with them. Now the other thing we have to do is notice here it says in exports vision API demo. This is the name of the function that we're exporting. So I'm going to put that right here under entry point. Now the only other thing we need is package JSON and that's just importing our dependencies, which is basically just storage and the Vision API in this case. So that should be good enough. We'll click Deploy, and that will deploy our function, and it'll take a couple minutes for that to be ready. Okay, my storage function is ready. Now we can test it out by uploading a picture to that bucket. So I have on my desktop a picture of my dog, Noir. So that's the picture we're gonna use. So let's go to Cloud Storage. Here's the bucket that we're triggering on, and we're just going to upload a file, and that's the file we're going to use, Noir. Okay, the file was uploaded. Let's go see if it worked. Let's go back to Cloud Functions. There's our storage function. And we'll click on Logs. And there we have the labels for my picture of Noir 2. So it found he's a dog and a carnivore and a terrier and so on and so forth. Anyway, that's how easy it is to create a cloud function that triggers on a file being uploaded to a cloud storage bucket. This is Doug Renstrom with ROI Training.